Before we go into the next session of education in Thailand, we have a very, very special uh, session. We would like to invite Dr. Sasitara Pichai Chanarong, Permanent Secretary of Ministry of Education of Thailand, to give us remarks to all of you. Dr. Sasitara, please. Dr. Sasitara, please be on stage. Sawadika and good morning. Did you learn this word, Sawadi? Could you say to me, Sawadika and Sawadi Krab? I didn't have a session to say today, but uh, I just passed by and just would like to give you a few minutes of what we have been do, uh, doing and preparing this project for months and months. Uh, for your information, this project came out three or four months ago. Your ambassador and uh, director of British Council, Chris, came to my office in the Ministry of Education. And then we decided that we would like to invite youth from the UK to come to Thailand to teach English lessons and to share experience together. And then the project began. We uh, were thinking what they should do while they were in Thailand. First, they have to teach English. And then I said, it would be good for you to uh, enjoy your life in Thailand, who have never been to this part of the world before. Not Thailand, huh? this part of the world, Asia. One, one fourth, is that right? about one-fourth. I think this is a very good opportunity for you and also for us to live together for six weeks. Uh, that's why we decided that this project should include both the training session during which you will teach English lessons through the good uh, handbooks and textbook of the British Council. Um, and then uh, the school will take care of you, taking you around to see the countries and uh, a lot of places and share some experiences with teachers, families and local people. The schools which uh, will receive you are here in this room. They are both from public schools and uh, private schools. In Thailand, we have uh, about 34,000 schools. I mean, in secondary schools, and uh, we are very eager to receive you in every part of Thailand. At the end of uh, your trip, I told my colleagues from the British Council and the lady from the British uh, Embassy, and also the two ladies who came from the UK, that probably we will do the farewell for you. So uh, we might feel something that you have shared your experience with my Thai colleagues during the six weeks. Uh, some of our ideas is that we gave you the mobile phones. So you will use this free of charge. And then I suggest that you take all the pictures like Facebook and uh, my other personnel have uh, already given you some instruction how you could upload on teachinthailand2012.com. So you will see how other people are working in various places. During these six weeks, me, Brett, and probably my colleagues from the ministry and from the British Council will travel around Thailand. We try to locate you, gather you together, and then do Skype back to the Great Britain. I hope that you would be there and chat with us during the six hour difference between Bangkok and London and Birmingham and Liverpool, I don't know where and that your parents, your friends would see how you are in Thailand. Parallel to this, we have launched a project as well with the Chinese. We were receiving 200 Chinese. Probably you will cross them somewhere in the country. It would be good as well to learn from them. 
how they enjoy their life during their six weeks as well in Thailand and how do you enjoy at the end of your stay if requested and if we feel that it's important we could issue you a certificate it would be beneficial for you as well to present this certificate from the Ministry of Education of Thailand and said wow you have been trained in Bangkok in Thailand and teaching English it might give you some credit when you employ for a job this is also the intention of this project. I have heard that some of you or one of you have already traveled to Thailand and already taught to my Thai people and you would like to go to the Red Cross. A lot of opportunity in this country is open to you. Just tell this to my colleagues, my Thai colleagues or your colleagues from the British Council. We will try to make it happen. And. Uh, you can reach in the iPad or in the internet where would you like to see in that province. I have uh, visited some of the Chinese in the eastern part of Thailand and uh, they asked the director of the school they would like to go to Chatuchak Market. You know Chatuchak Market? It's a flea market. I think that you should go. Some, some of you might have been yesterday. Yeah? Yesterday you have been to the Chatuchak. We call this JJ market. It's like a flea market in your country, but it's much more amazing. So, <laughs> have you been there yesterday? No? Uh, there's a lot of things to see. The other place is the seashore, like Pattaya. It's very good as well. Uh, during a one hour and a half drive, they could bring you to the sea sand sand. We call the active beach. And more and more and more that you can see in this country. We are one of the top 10 tourist destinations of the world as well. Actually, we receive uh, nearly 20 million tourist arrival in Thailand, which uh, increase about uh, 12 to 15 percent of the previous. So I hope you good luck and enjoy your stay. If you uh, would like to eat some European food, you can try to do so. As your director of the schools or the Thai, we are very friendly. As uh, the lady from the embassy uh, suggested you, be careful with those who have never eaten hot and spicy food. Uh, those who are going to the northeastern part, you might know the word som tam. Som tam is the papaya salad. It's good to try, but it might give you uh, some difficulty in your stomach. <laughs> and then uh, what should I tell them to, for the uh, water? Be careful as well for the water that you drink. And also uh, for those who might be uh, strange to you and tell the director or those who are uh, near you. I am quite sure that it would be safe for those who are coming to Thailand, but by the way, it's it's a, a very good caution to be aware of what is happening to you because you are still young. And I think that it a very, it's a very good date. I mean, good age to come outside the country at your age, to come for the first time in the country. I have done the same thing when I was at your age to go to Europe as well. And uh, I think that I enjoy very much. So you would share the same experience as us. We will see you tonight for the reception that will be chaired by your ambassador and the Minister of Education. Tomorrow you will have the final session of introduction to Thailand and then you will leave to so many schools around Thailand. After six weeks, we'll come back again and hope that uh, we would enjoy the farewell party and don't cry because you have to leave my country so soon. <laughs> thank you very much and enjoy your stay and thank you the British Council for the two ladies who are coming from the UK, the lady who are coming from the embassy, and all of us, my colleagues as well, the inspector generals, the deputy permanent secretary, and all the staff who have been at the airport since uh, Friday. Another two are expected to come today and one more on Saturday. No problem and don't worry, we'll take care of them well. Thank you very much and enjoy. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Dr. Sasitara Vishay Chanarong.
Permanent Secretary of Ministry of Education for very nice remarks and good advice for you guys, especially for those who are the first time in Thailand. And you will see her again tonight at the reception at the Hyatt Erwan Hotel.